What's going on guys, Team Mart here and uh, today is a pretty exciting afternoon. We just got the official Black Ops 3 launch trailer that showcases a little bit of single player, a little bit of multiplayer, and a little bit of zombies. It's really not a very long trailer, it doesn't give us all that much information, but uh, you know, it's kind of showing you a little bit of everything you're going to be able to expect once you get your hands on the game on November 6th. So uh, if you guys want to watch the trailer, I'll link it down in the description, but what we're going to do is go through and talk about the highlighted points that I noticed when I watched this thing. So uh, first up is we get our first in-game look at Marshawn Lynch. Check it out, baby. Money Lynch, he's just there so he won't get fine. I'm so excited to uh, to see him in this campaign. I think he's an absolute character and uh, I think it's going to be really, really funny when he pops up. So I can't wait to uh, see what they do with him. But uh, yeah, that's the first look at him in game. Next up, we did get to see a, a couple of new multiplayer maps and see them from different angles and stuff like that. So there's this one right here that seems to be kind of like a, a giant wreckage site out in like the, the desert. There are like rock outcroppings all over the place and broken buildings and jets and stuff. And uh, you guys can see it actually, it looks pretty interesting. It looks very wide open. It looks like that's going to be a fantastic spot for, uh, for score streaks. Now, uh, next up, we see kind of like a, um, a futuristic, but also old at the same time city. Like in the background, those buildings look super futuristic, but here, uh, right in the foreground, they look super old and like they're, you know, kind of antiques or whatever you want to say. And it looks like it's, it's kind of like a, a city on the, the cliff side, maybe or something like that. I don't know. It looks pretty interesting to me. We have a, a couple of different, uh, different angles here. Uh, next up we have, uh, we've already seen Redwood before, but we saw a couple of new, uh, kind of angles from it. So you guys can see here, here he is kind of slamming down to the ground, uh, in, in between the, uh, the Redwood trees and stuff like that. Then we saw this. This is, uh, I think, you know, they talked about when we first heard of Redwood, they talked about how there's going to be like this huge, like wall running kind of combo that you're going to be able to do to completely flank around the enemies. And uh, this kind of looks like this might be what they're talking about. Like this little alley, there's like a, a big crevice that goes down below. If you fall, you die and stuff like that. So uh, that's kind of cool. And uh, then finally, last but not least, probably the most exciting part of this trailer is this right here. Look at this character customization on this Reaper. This is not the normal Reaper that you see, like the, the brownish, grayish, you know, kind of like sandy color that he normally is. This has like a, a customization camo applied to the player. And you guys can see it's like up top on his helmet, on his arms and stuff like that. It's even down low on his legs. And uh, yeah, so that's kind of our first look at some of the options for character customization. We've heard about it, they've teased it, they've announced it, stuff like that, but we have yet to see it in game until this point. And I'm interested to see just how far and you know how much more they're gonna have available in the full game. So uh, yeah, there you guys have it. Like I said, very short trailer, really not that much information to see, but I wanted to bring it up to you guys in case you guys missed it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys check out the other video I put up very, very early this morning if you guys missed it. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.